welcome back to my channel or if you're new welcome I make videos every Monday Wednesday and Friday and today we are doing another video in my bougie on a budget series so I recently posted a video I will link it down below about all of my favorite pieces from Walmart and you guys really really love that video and a lot of you guys messaged me showing me the pieces you actually got from Walmart which I love so if you end up picking any of the pieces from anything I show up then I love when you guys show me it makes my whole day but today I thought I would do something a little bit different I am going to be talking all about bathing suits bikinis cover ups cover ups cover ups hats all of the best bikini products but we are not going to break the bank for this I don't know about you guys but I don't know why I've always been so confused about why bikinis or bathing suits in general are so expensive if you look online bathing suits are really cute but they're like $100 for the top and $100 for the bottom. And I refuse to spend that much money. Even the bathing suit stores like Bikini Village and all of those stores, I have two bikinis and it costed me $400. I work with manufacturers that manufacture these people, these other companies' bikinis, and I'm not trying to throw shade at any company, but it doesn't cost anywhere near $80 to $100 for a bathing suit top. Sorry but to do this because it's warm weather even though right now it's not so warm outside. It's like it's like warm but it's cloudy and I'm looking at my window it's kind of sad actually. It's kind of different from my last bougie on a budget video but I want to show you guys and do all the work for you going to all of these different stores finding the best cost per wear and showing you guys where you should could find amazing bathing suits instead of having to go hunt them down yourselves and I don't want you to break the bank for this I'm also not going to be talking about Zafool or any of those websites because A I'm really tired of seeing Zafool videos not gonna lie B it's very hit or miss with Zafool like you can either get a bunch of things that are amazing or you can get a bunch of things that you've wasted your money on C it takes a long time to get in and D I find that it's really important to try bathing suits on. Personally, I would prefer to try bathing suits on in store before I spend any kind of money on them. Whether it's $20, $100, I would just prefer to look at it in store. Sometimes you can find bikinis that look cheap, but I want to find the best bikinis from these stores that actually look really expensive and look like you spent upwards of 60 to $100. I'm not 100% sure of all the stores I'm going to look at. I'm going to kind of go as I go, but for sure I want to look at Walmart. I saw a lot of actually really cute bikinis at Walmart. I want to look at Winners. I want to look at Forever 21. I'm going to look at Arden. I would look at H&M, but the H&M in my mall is closed. The only one is all the way downtown, which is like an hour away from me. I think it's time to go hit the stores. We're going to leave. I'm going to take you to the stores with me, and we'll see what we can find. Maybe we won't find anything. I don't know. We'll see. But I think we should hit the stores. So, for my outfit today, I wore something that I probably shouldn't have because I should probably wear something that's really easy to take off and put on. For shopping but I wanted to wear jeans today I've been really into jeans so this top is from misguided then for my jeans these are $22 Zara jeans I got them last summer actually and can we just take a minute to admire how flat they make my butt look I paired it with my Gucci belt because they are a little bit loose on my waist and then I have my just fabulous these were four Okay, so 
This yellow is really in right now, and they also have lemon. Oh my god. <laughs> Can you do anything right? <laughs> Size small. Oh my god, this is different, but this is pretty <gasps> Okay, so I was gonna get this because it is nice, it's cute, but it's twenty-four dollars and I I don't think it's worth twenty four dollars and I'm not gonna wear it. So am I gonna wear it? No. No. But I got some cute cover ups. It just looks very far apart. We'll try it. Very cute. Okay, didn't know this was turning into shop and spray. Okay, guys, so we're dealing with an actual problematic shopaholic. She doesn't know it yet, but I'm planning her intervention. So now we're going to our den. I didn't find any business with that Zara, but I didn't think I would, even though I have in the past. So I think our den is going to be our last spot. Winners give me anxiety, so we skip that one. Eat a lot of bikinis in our den. Okay, I really like this. It's in. That style in. I just thought it was such a super cute. This is like a classic everyone needs. I love. This is an extra small. It's like... not an extra small, but it's all they have. Extra large. Extra small. Oh Okay, we're going with extra small for now. Okay, and they have these bottoms here. I just want to see what's going on. Okay, so the same hat they have at Walmart, they have it here for $12.80. So Walmart loses in this one. But it depends on what you like. This has red writing and it says hello sunshine. So I'm just going to jump in and tell you guys what stores were successful and what stores weren't. You saw the first store I went to was Walmart. And Walmart turned out to be one of the most successful stores and the least expensive stores. I'm not surprised because we all know I love Walmart. My favorite style of bikini is this style where it looks kind of like a bra. And I also got the matching bottoms. The bottoms are nice because it has the same pattern. I personally just like matching bikinis, you know, when you have like the same pattern on the top or bottom or all black or all white or like all nude. I just like that I don't know why I like I personally like that better. You always they can mix and match your bikinis, but I like when they match. So I thought that this would look really cute and I really like the pattern, the floral print on this. It's something different. I don't have any floral print bikinis. The top was 14 and the bottom was 14. So this bikini was $30 total, which I think is really, really good. Okay, so this is the first bathing suit. I'm so in love with it. This top exceeded all of my expectations. It's like pushing my boobs together and get lifting them up, but without looking weird and having weird padding. It's really easy to get cheap looking floral prints, so I'm really happy that this one doesn't look cheap. The bottoms fit really nicely and I'm so happy with this. Next, I don't know, this is the one I saw at the Walmart near me that they didn't have my size and the one that I fell in love with and like wanted but th they didn't have my size. So this is um, like a striped color and I don't know why I was so into this striped color and I got the matching bottoms. I just think it's so fun and so cute. The colors are really nice. Like I like the tones of the colors, which is really important. And I just was instantly drawn to this. I'm not normally a huge color person. These were the same price, and I got the matching bottoms in a size small. So this is the next pattern. It looks really cute also. Um, I don't know why this one's feeling a little bit more snug. It feels weird to be wearing so much color, but I actually like it a lot. I really like how this looks, but I think instead of pairing it with like the matching bottoms, I think I would pair this with one of these colored bottoms. I think that would look cute. I feel like pairing it with the matching bottoms is a little bit too much. This was $7, you guys. $7. So this might be like the best purchase of the whole thing because I love bikini tops that look like this. You can just mix and match this with any pair of black bottoms. I did buy a pair of black bottoms but um, I didn't buy them from Walmart so I also have other black bottoms so I didn't want to buy them just to buy them because I do have other black bottoms okay you guys this bikini is a game changer I cannot believe that this was only seven dollars when certain bikinis online going for like $50 look like this so I got a size small and I think it fits really perfectly I like it because it like 
pushes the boob in it like comes from the side and like pushes it in then i went to forever 21 and they had so many bikinis so if you want to take the time and go through all of the bathing suits try them on i tried on a few but i didn't find any that i absolutely fell in love with and thought that i needed so i didn't get any of those at forever 21 but i did get something else i did buy other stuff while i was shopping too which is going to be in the summer haul but i wanted to show you guys this this was one thing i bought at forever 21 it was a little bit more expensive this was 52 dollars i didn't buy it as a swim cover up i actually bought it to be as like a little throw over sweater because it's really really cute but basically i just thought that you could make any of the most inexpensive bathing suit look super super cute super posh super bougie if you throw this on so the crochet detailing is really nice it has kind of like a scalloped bottom and I just pictured this with a black bikini underneath or a white bikini and it's really really cute I really like that and that's a really easy way to dress up um, a bikini or anything it is a little bit more expensive when I saw that I was like $52 like that's that's pretty up there in price but then I also thought like it's not just a pool cover up. I had it on with my outfit that I was wearing and it looked really cute. So I didn't just think of this as a pool cover up. You can wear it both ways. And then I went to Garage. Now Garage, they had some cute bathing suits, but I don't know why they were so, like the chest area was so separated that when I put it on, my nipples were like hanging out. I also know that Airy has really nice bathing suits. My sister Allie actually went and got a lot of bathing suits there. They are more expensive than these, but they are not as expensive as like 80 to 100 dollars so if you are looking for that mid-price bathing suit i would check out airy i did go to our den though and i found really cute bikinis they have a lot I actually got kicked out of our den for filming but that's another story i was able to get my bikini and you have a lot of bikinis that look kind of cheap but they do have a lot of bikinis if you look for them that look really cute but the first bikini i got was this one right here this one right here Actually, the one I bought for like $300 looks identical to this. That's kind of sad. It literally looks identical to this. And this was $15.50. So, this one's really cute. It has removable padding, which is always nice to give yourself a little bit of a oomph, you know? It's adjustable, so you can make it as tight or as loose as you want. And then I also got these super cute frill bottoms, which I thought were just so adorable. These were... $14.90 but at our den it was buy one get one half off so I got one bikini and then I got this one half off I love good deals when she told me that I almost screamed because I was so happy I was like your bathing suits are already really affordable and you just made them 10 times more affordable okay so this is by far one of my favorite bikinis out of all of them these bottoms have frills on them and I find that they're so adorable and the frills on this actually match is like the little frills that are here I actually took out the padding that was in the top because it was just too much when it was in and I think it looks so, so cute I absolutely love this I think you're supposed to put the sleeves on your arms like this but I actually liked it when it was like this more I bought the bottoms too I thought they were really cute i'm not sure exactly what this pattern is called but it is really popular right now so i got this one this set for half off so let's see i got this bikini for 15 dollars. this one is not adjustable i got the size small okay guys how freaking adorable is this bathing suit obviously like i said i wear my bathing suits a little bit higher but oh my god i am so obsessed i think arden wins this one because these bathing suits are super cute and i got this one for 15 dollars and this one if you told me was over 100 dollars, i believe it too arden is all about looking i cannot believe i can't believe this you guys my sister's gonna die over this one and you can like undo it if you want and like untie it you can like go like that so those are the bikinis that i managed to pick up i'm so happy with the ones that i got and the stuff from forever 21 i hope you guys enjoyed this video let me know if you thought it was helpful and if you're going to be picking up some of these pieces and let me know what store you want me to do next in this series down below don't forget to hit that subscribe button and like this video and i will see you guys next time